Yo, how's it going everyone? Um, I'm doing something a little different today. We are checking out something that I find a little creepy. Um, a little bit of scary, a little spooky. It's really not that bad. It, it really isn't. Um, but it's something that happened in the last like week. Um, but I wanted to share with you. I found it pretty interesting, uh, because I don't know why they went this route. Uh, but starting first, I wanted to talk about why I'm doing this in the first place. Um, I have been having internet issues. Uh, it's been driving me insane. I've done any, every, everything from replacing ethernet wires to getting a new modem, getting a new router, um, calling up our ISP to replace like things to like, uh, like connection connectors and things like that. And so now the next step is to call our ISP back and have them replace the wiring inside the walls. Uh, which I think they're going to just do it the simpler way, which is just not using the ones that are in the walls and then drilling out a hole to put the wire from the outside in. If I remember correctly, that's what they're going to do. So yeah, we have them doing that there and hopefully that will finish or fix everything and we can go back to the stream because the streams have been scuffed. But that's why I am doing this today. Um, but yeah, so today we're here to talk about something massive something huge something probably bigger than you probably bigger than the house you live in it's probably bigger than this apartment that i live in i don't actually know how tall this is uh it is a 27 foot giant baby named lily and so why are we talking about lily so lily is a giant baby who made a surprise visit to rochdale rochdale uh england if i remember correctly uh where they're gonna have school children go and tell voice their opinions on climate change and what they can do for, about the environment and animals and just you know try to help be a little more earth conscious environmentally friendly i don't know why it's a baby maybe it's to signify you know starting new i don't know i don't know that's just me pulling something out of my ass um but in reality it's part of an event called wild wanders illuminated woodland trail where you're gonna be able to walk through a trail that's illuminated. <laughs> Could you have guessed that? It's it's illuminated with lights. Uh, I think I've seen something say about fire. Not entirely sure about that. Let's hope there's not fire because I feel like that gets rid of the climate. Uh, what's it called? Climate change issue. Um, so let's just hope they're doing uh, environmentally friendly lights. Uh, but yeah, it'll take place at Hollingworth Lake Country Park. I don't know if that's supposed to be county. I've been saying county when I was reading it. Turns out it's country. But look how terrifying this baby is, dude. This is with the eyes closed. What made them think that eyes closed was good? I mean, but it's not terrible with the eyes open. There are people controlling it. But holy crap, is this thing scary looking. And it just, it, apparently it came out of nowhere. People were kind of freaked out by it when it first uh, popped up until they really um, saw and heard what it's about. Um, but there are still people who feel... It is a little weird. One person told BBC Radio Manchester that uh, they've never seen anything like this in Rochdale before. While another said it was like something from Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. <laughs> I don't exactly remember that. I don't remember there being like a giant baby, but who knows? But yeah, uh, right here. I came around the corner. I thought it's just creepy with eyes shut. Never mind open. Imagine you didn't know or you just kind of saw this peeking over whatever building. Like you just saw like this little corner of the head or this side technically. And you're like, oh, let me go check out what that is. And you just see a giant baby sitting there with its eyes closed. Look at this. This is terrifying. <laughs> this is terrifying. I love the message, but holy crap. Is that scary, man? But yeah, I mean, I do think it's pretty cool. The kids can go up. Let me see if I can find it. Um, uh, let's see. Thanks to all the local children who come to meet Lily, the giant baby, sharing their thoughts on the future of our environment, their hopes for protecting animals and nature, and the world they want to live alongside with her. And so the cool thing about this is the, the kids are going to go up, and I'm assuming talking into this baby's belly. And then the conversations are recorded and will be broadcasted from the baby when it's relocated to the park. The park that the event is going to be taking place at. If I lived in the UK or in Europe or, I mean, what, what do you guys call it? England? Um, I would 100% go to this and look at this terrifying looking baby. Uh, and yeah, I, I just think it's, it's, this thing is scary, man. This thing is weird. Um... 
Let's the Illuminated Nature Trail out there. Project aims to amplify the children's voice in the crucial conversation about climate change, which is a very important talk to have. I just don't think that this terrifying ass baby is the one to do it for us. You know what I mean? Um, yeah, sorry this was so short. I know it's like really random. It's definitely different than what I usually do. Uh, but it's something I've been wanting to do in general. Find like weird things on the internet, creepy things, and talk about them. Like I said, this isn't that bad. It's just the idea behind this baby is terrifying. The, it, it looks cool. I think they did a great job. But I don't know if that was the right thing to do. But anyways, I'm Young Wushu. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you guys like this, let me know down in the comments. You can even join the Discord and let me know how you feel about it there. Because I really want to do more things like this. You can even join the Discord and send me things that you think that I would be interested in. And maybe I'll even talk about it here. If this is something you like, we can make this more. We can change the channel up from horror games to this. If you guys really like me just sitting here yapping with you guys. Um, but anyways, yeah, join the Discord, like and comment, share it with your grandma, share it with your favorite auntie. If you don't have a favorite auntie, share it with your least favorite auntie. Um, let her hate me too, okay? You know what I mean? We're in this together. If you don't hate me, I don't hate you, but your auntie can hate you, and then she can hate me, okay? Alright, peace out. Bye-bye. See you guys later. See ya. Bye-bye. See ya. Peace out. Bye-bye.